Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Lufia and the Fortress of Doom. We are in Aris, looking for the Professor, I believe. Uh, I had forgotten <laughs> why I was here last time, the end of last, uh, last uh, episode, because, uh, you know, there was a lot of other stuff going on that uh, easily distracted me from what we're supposed to be doing. Hello! Like with a stupid fetch quest. I see you managed to get through the cave. You must be excellent warriors. No, we just have a lot of patience. Oh. Oh, yeah, I suppose that's the case, too. Professor Rail is here, but he's at the Tower of Grief right now. Interesting man. You should meet him. The tower is west of the village. You could get there through a small cave. Oh, God, not another cave. Oh, I must have gotten that already. Ring-shaped island to the west was created when Doom Island fell. It's a real creepy-looking place. Well, I think we're gonna be going there some at some point. And I got that already. All right. Yeah, people in this village are magicians. We locked the cave door. How did you get through? Uh, Lufia opened it. Only the most skilled magician is supposed to know the spell. Lufia, eh? You're very experienced, I see. No, not really. You should meet the Elder in the Tower of Grief. If you're a magician, you can learn a lot from him. Oh, oh, is he a crash test dummy? Alright, well, I guess we're uh, heading over to the Tower of Grief. After we go through a cave. Uh, let's see. Yeah, Gro, you go after the ghoul. Ow! Rude. And all dead. Excellent, no waste of turns. All will be going up a level pretty soon. Let's go ahead and heal up uh, Lufia a little bit. Okay. Uh, good news is that there are no items in this cave. It's not very long at all. But why even put a cave like this in here? That might be why. <laughs> Just to be mean. Armor Lord. Well, uh, the good news is that we can... We don't have to worry about uh, wasted turns here. So close to leveling up. Ice snacks! This was a good boom. Ow! Ow! My face! Yeah, I'll only heal when we get, a, a bu uh, get below uh, 100 hit points, I think. Critical. Not necessary, but I appreciate it nonetheless. And uh, the Ice Snake 2 was carrying a Sleep Arrow. All its level is up. 5 hit points, 4 MP, 5 strength, 4 magic resistance. Not too shabby. Alright, let's see. Let's look for the uh, treasures. Because that's the most important thing, right? Uh... Go ahead and bang them all.
Bang would probably have taken care of them, but... Plasma, ow, root. Would you stop that? Well, at least high arrows don't do much damage anymore. Someone needs some healing badly, though. Uh, let's see. Alt's okay. Aguro. Uh, let's heal you twice. Lufia needs some healing. Jaren's okay for now. Alt found a purple ring. Alright, so defense goes up, intelligence goes up, agility goes up, magic resistance goes up. Is that just a, like a better blue ring? Because nothing's going down. Hold on a second. So I have the blue ring. Uh, 10 attack power, 8 defense. Purple ring is 10 attack power, 11 defense, 4 intelligence, 2 agility, 5 magic resistance. That's good. Um, let's see, you have the yellow ring, which would take magic resistance and defense down. The red ring, you'd lose intelligence and agility. lose agility. Yeah, alright. Yeah, it's just a better uh, blue ring. So, let's go ahead and mix in a little uh, red with this blue ring. That's pretty nice. It's a shame they don't have more interesting names than <laughs> red ring, blue ring, purple ring, that sort of thing. Uh, a revive, a stone cure, and a dragon egg. Didn't take any damage, so that is fine. All right, I think we want to get rid of the uh, the pumpkins first because uh, they're kind of nasty. I mean, so are the snakes, but. I don't know, I feel the pumpkins might be... Oh, well, Jaren got an attack off already, so... You're gonna shield, that's okay. Jaren stops shaking. And uh, they're all dead. Getting good amounts of XP now, though. That's pretty nice. Uh, let us go with a flash on the U. Kill him. Critical. Mm, Alt's getting a little low on hit points. But I'll still stick with uh, going below 100. Alright, we got a uh, pair of stairs here, which, well, actually we got more than a pair of stairs. Okay. Let's take the first ones. Yeah, we also have uh, clearly a divided pathway there. Uh, once again, go ahead and flash that one. I probably shouldn't have Lufia flashing all the time, I don't know.
Someone might arrest her. Yeah, you guys waste your turns. That's fine with me. That is perfectly fine with me. and a stone cure. Are you telling me something, game? Because it's a, it's a few stone cures that I've gotten so far. Are you trying to tell me something? Uh, let's see. Do I want to do the do? Let's try do. Not enough. I was afraid of that. Rude. Rude. That is extremely rude game. That is extremely rude. Well, you know all those revives that I, uh... I got... Thanks, game. I appreciate that as well. Lufia falls asleep. But at least Aguro got stronger. There we go. Alright. So, we gotta bang or water them or something like that. Alright, so these stairs and the lower left, the lower right stairs. Um, those all, those are progress. The uh, other one, the lower uh, left, that's going to be some more treasure. If we can get rid of these guys in time. Don't put Luffy to sleep, that's rude. Stop that. They're so rude. You're going after the Halloweens? I'm sure they do something other than shield, right? I would think. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, that's not dead. I, I expected death. Queue up their attacks for uh, afterwards, but they still get their attacks beforehand, which is interesting. X potion and high magic. Should have just walked off. Shield, that's fine. That Jaren's attack's gonna miss. Oh well. Gonna take care of this uh, ghoulish ghoul. Get a little bit of healing going as well.
and then up here. Alright, uh, blue wisps, huh? Let's just go ahead and bang them. And... We'll do that. Let's see how that goes. Yeah, that has uh, that attack has not kept up with uh, our hit points. One thousand XP though. Exactly. That's nice. Oh, I think these are gonna heal hit points. Yep. And magic points. Yep. Oh, hello. I'm Flake, Elder of Aris. You fought the Sinistrals. You know about that? Feel the energy and you'll know right away. Strong power, I sense great ability. You can see through Alt's character. People are always more than they appear to be. I feel like that was a backhanded insult there. Backhanded compliment. Akuro, don't be rude. Yep, yep. <laughs> it's alright. The truth is always best. More importantly, who removed the magic barrier to the village? I did. You must have great skill to remove such a barrier. Come here. Your powers will grow. I sense much potential. Really? Oh, yes. But you've only begun to understand. Let me help you. Close your eyes. All right. Awake, I call upon those powers yet untouched. Come forth. Luffy's maximum MP increases by 10. I mean, I'm thankful for that, but she's the one who doesn't really need that at the moment. Wow. I knew exactly what happened. It's like I could see the game rules. Magic increased merely by those simple words. Can you do the same to me? Uh, no, you're an incompetent. It's not my power. She's always had it. I simply drew it out. I had no idea it was there. You learned through battle. That's the hard way. Had you studied, you'd have discovered it earlier. I can't thank you enough. I sense a great imbalance. I fear we may see the return of Deus and the Sinistrals. We're looking for Professor Rail. Do you know him? He returned to the lab. You just missed him. Dang it, he must have walked off the edge of the tower. Well, I'm gonna take your miracle. Listen, hide your weakness. Never let the Sinistral see it. Only courage and strength can defeat them. Okay. Hey! Hey! Excuse me. I was talking to the old man, sir. Sirs. How rude. Jeez. Alright, 10 damage from Lufia may not actually help much. I wonder if I could go down, heal up, and then walk off. Probably not worth it. Now let's just go. Whee! Hi, monsters. How are you? Jaren should kill the last one of these uh, pin lizards. They look very happy.
Maybe they want to die. Right, let's not forget this time. Although, I am going to a town. I should probably just teleport. Let's go to the town first. We'll, uh, we'll rest at the inn. It's right here. Okay, so we need to go back to the lab. Uh, warp. I guess we go to Odell. And then, uh, it's gonna be down in the basement, isn't it? Want to say anything different? They say Professor Rail made a ship that dives. Must be a submarine, I guess. <laughs> um. It was a more well informed uh, lady than I expected. Welcome to Shire Lab 2. Professor Rail should be in Lab 1. You can reach it from the basement. Professor Rail is amazing. He recently made a ship that goes underwater. Well, we want that. Tunnels ahead, travel in four directions. Harris Cave is north, Shia Lab is west, Plains are south, east returns you here. Alright, so Shia Lab 1 is west. Not that it, like, pops up sane where I am. Uh, the uh, sign, though. Professor Rail is back from the village. I think he's upstairs. Well, let's go talk to him. Do you know the Isle of Forfeit? Uh, no. It's a small island off, off of Serenigal. They say the items you've sold to shops are there. You can visit it if you have a ship. I hear it also has some other interesting shops. I would definitely like to find out. Hey, don't touch anything without asking. The other day, a man touched a machine that turns people into frogs. That was a tough one. Why did you build that? Uh, well, it's the same reason people climb mountains, because it's there. But what happened to him? Uh, too bad that. I made a new frog to people machine. But he came back as a snake instead. Hmm. Snake? Snake! Snake! Um, player, that's the wrong reference. Uh, then he became a lizard. Uh, then an iguana. Uh, some people are just unlucky, I guess. What kind of lizard did he become before he became an iguana? Because iguanas are lizards. Did he ever return to normal? Oh, yes. After three days, I, he said, I never want to see a lizard's face as long as I live. <laughs> I feel sorry for him. Excuse me, who are you anyway? You don't look like my lab students. I'm Ald. These are my friends, Aguro, Jaren, and Lufia. We're looking for Rail Shia. Would that be you? Yes, it would. I am the genius Rail Shia. Why the face? You don't believe me, is that it? No, it's just that usually people don't refer to themselves as geniuses. N no, no, uh, of course not, but... Yeah, all right, I'll prove it to you. You look like fighters. Wait right here. Wait, wait, what? How about this tonic? With this, you'll be- you'll have four arms! Be twice as strong! No, I don't want to be Hextor. Well, well, no, I don't think so. No, oh, I've already run experiments on this, so the effects are guaranteed. You did? On who? Well, let's see, you're Jaren, right? For you... 
Um, I noticed he didn't answer that question. This is perfect. It's guaranteed to make your hair grow. Really? Well, maybe I could try... Don't you dare. I see. You won't like it if my hair looks better than yours. <laughs> Even if you try it, my hair will still be longer. Isn't that right, Ald? What? Well, I wouldn't know. I've never really thought about that. Can't you tell? Where are your eyes anyway? I'm not always looking at your hair. Hey, Ald. Lufia. Uh, what are you two talking about? Right, we're not here to talk about hair. We're here for a ship that goes under the sea. We're looking for a crab named S Sebastian. Wait, was, the was that the crab's name or was that the flounder's name? It's been a really long time since I've seen that. Oh, you mean Falcon, one of my best inventions. You didn't happen to steal that from another game, did you? Ah, uh, yeah, maybe. And Falcon can really travel underwater? I'm gonna call it Narwhal. Not only that, it can fly through the air! Wow, where is it? It's docked in the basement. I normally don't show it to anyone. However, I'll let you see it. R really? Just, just like that. Just like that. Okay. Just a second. I'll open the door. It's so tiny. This is Falcon. Isn't she amazing? Oh, this ship is covered with dust! And the wings are a little chipped. Hmm, there's a hole in the ceiling. Sorry to ask, but you've never used Falcon before, have you? How did you know that? Well, anyone could tell just by looking at it. Well, if that's all you have to say, I'll give you a demonstration. Right now? You wanted to use Falcon, didn't you? I'm saying you can't. Are you having second thoughts? Actually, he's right. Are you seriously getting into this thing? What are you waiting for? Let's go! Come on, we need the we need this ship to find the dual blade. Everyone ready? Ahead half speed! Prepare to dive! Is this vessel really seaworthy? What do you take me for? I mean it seems okay. Hey, it's leaking. Are you sure we won't sink? We're fine. Pipe down. I'm getting soaked. Prepare to surface. I think traveling above the sea was a better idea. Will you be quiet? You amateurs know nothing. Yeah, there's a slight problem. Underwater navigation is impossible. There is no problem on the surface, though. Of course, I can repair it, but my equipment isn't here. Come to Shia Lab 3 later. Straight west of here. He ran away, didn't he? I guess so. He just wanted to leave us with this contraption, didn't he? He's different, that's for sure. But somehow I like him. It doesn't seem so bad. Anyway, we can travel across the sea now. Let's make good use of it. Let's head for Shia Lab 3. He said we could he could repair Falcon, right? Well, we have a boat now, so there's that. Uh, we could go to the uh, Isle of Forfeit. Uh, let's see. Need to look to see exactly where we are, and how do we get to the Isle of Forfeit? All right, let's go. At least uh, movement on the sea is pretty quick. Uh, but there are encounters. Red stars. Actually, it is about time to end the episode. See if we can just, like, uh, pull off the shore. And I can uh, teleport back to Platina. I'm curious if this game will move the boat with you like uh, it does in Dragon Quest. So 
Let's find uh, that out. Killer eels? Well, let's be the killers here. Mostly opened up to us if uh, we can just disembark anywhere we want. Good XP here. Yes, we can. Okay. So now the uh, next question. Let's go to Serenigal. Yes, it does. All right. Well, when we come back next time, we are going to the town of Forfeit. See you then, everyone.